Yo, 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 what's going on? This is your boy, Eddie Fo, man. I wanted to uh, speak on this high boy reunion, Louisiana Fest, uh, back on uh, November 2nd, a couple days ago. You know what I'm saying? Like, this monumental, like, big for the culture, big for New Orleans, big for Louisiana as a whole, big for hip-hop. You see what I'm saying? Big for rap. Because I came up off of this. You know what I'm saying? Skipping school, going to get that first Lil Wayne album. The block is hot. You know what I'm saying? Where he ain't had not one cussing word on there except for one song. And that was called Fuck the World. And I think that was the only cuss word he said. Numerous times. You feel me? But yeah. BG and Turk, they was going at it when Turk, when BG got out. He said, God damn, Turk was uh making money off the free BG shirts. Didn't send no money. Leaking phone calls and shit. Trying to sue Bird, man. Wayne had his shit going, you know, they, well, he was cool with all of them. But him and Bird, man, they patched up their little shit a few years back. Manny Fresh. So we had everybody, the whole hot boys and the big timers. They all, I ain't going to say they all cool, but they patched their shit up on behalf of, you know, making this shit happen for the fans, man. And that's exactly what the fuck we needed, bro. You know what I'm saying? All boys to the side is what we needed. Big fan from the bling bling to the Turk Young and Thuggin album. That is in me, little Wally. The man, come on, man. Come on, man. Why that fuck you with hey, 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 hey. And shout out to my man's with the uh on the content. You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna double back and catch your name, but uh I wanna put that out there though. A lot of niggas don't be giving niggas they 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 flowers on the content that they be using to, to make their content. So I feel about a certain nigga, but you know at the end of the day, even though I still feel how I feel about a certain nigga, but you know at the end of the day it is what it is. So he was talking about Turk right there. See, he gonna make it happen even though he feel his way about a, about a certain nigga. You know what I'm saying? It is what it is. He gonna make it happen for the fans, man. And that was a good look, man. BG fresh out, nigga. You did 12 years, man. 12, what? 12, 14 years, bro. You don't need to be getting out on that, man. You don't need to be getting out on that, man. They granted you a chance to get out here and, 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 and do your thing. Man, I get to it, man. I wanted to show my mask. Go ahead and uh, check him out though. So we had that. So then you fast forward to the to the reunion. Oh, that Turk! I'm telling you, man. Turk was nice though. Turk was nice. I ain't scared, I ain't scared to lose my life. See, and that was on that Guerrilla Warfare. See, like, come on, man. I was, that was me. I was a fan, bro. I'm telling you, man, that was my shit. Then you had Jizzle after him. <laughs> Packed up by the best fresh dropping beat after beat. My click is the high boys must believe we so hot. 
And the dangerous and will be will clear the whole block. So man, you know, like I say, it was a, it was, it was, it was, it was a good monumental night for that for the crowd, man, for for hip hop, for everybody, man, in this culture, man. I want to see more of that. You know what I'm saying? BG, Turk, man, y'all go ahead and patch y'all little shits up, man, because it seemed like it was all, out of them six, it was always a two, two, and two. You see what I'm saying? Like, Juvie and Manny, they was the coolest. Uh, Then you had Turk, BG. I mean, yeah, uh, one, Turk and BG. You had Wayne and Birdman. You know what I mean? Like they would, man, it's hard to explain it, man. But uh, y'all like, comment, subscribe, man. It's your boy 84. We out.